Hey everybody, Teach Plays here. Uh, I might be a little bit quieter than normal. Um, I'm trying a new mic level because I listened to episode 7 or 6 and I realized you can hear me mouth breathing the whole time and I'm so sorry for that. Uh, I am a heavy breather. Um, so hopefully this makes it better. Uh, yeah, so I can't remember what we were doing. I think we rescued that dude's stuff from the trolls or the goblins we fought some spiders and it looks like oh we're gonna track this quest nope why does it do that we're gonna track that quest to my right can i like go in the water what happens if i go in the water it's very shallow water oh looks like there's a oh this was a mistake now i'm just wading through stuff um I just want to make sure I'm recording. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, strange. Okay, let's talk to this person who's just sitting on a dock. Oh, look at that. That's cool. I beseech you for some assistance. Hello. Can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes. My name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid! Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help mm -hmm. retrieving? Mm -hmm. Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrally vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. Hmm. Hmm. It sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand. But I'd be forever grateful. I might feel bad not like course, you know how I you haven't been. <laughs> much more than the you know how we haven't been. Um... Anything else you found would be all yours. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last or alleged location been, uh, against recording. the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. We'll let her finish talking, My best and then I'll guess is point. that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. Like, I do I'm gonna hope feel find the astrolabe. Really bad. It would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just it. northeast of the dock. Northeast. I should dive down and see. North. Let's go. Huh. Okay, you can swim. Oh, there's some rocks. Uh, I, I'll feel bad if I don't return it, because like the whole time I've been playing as a jerk, but I think we have to keep up the facade. Right? Because we were playing we decided we were gonna play as a jerk, let's keep that going. This must be where the Pinch Smedley family astrolabe is. Okay, so you can't actually go underwater, you're just searching these different areas. Do I get gloves? I wonder if it'll be in the last one you check. I'm getting stuff, which is nice. Is this, this the lake that they... I wonder if... Is this the lake that they could do when they do that... Tournament in Harry Potter and there's like bad things underneath it? Well, considering there's giant spiders in the forest, like... It's probably not good. And it was in the last place. Of course it was. So are we giving it back to her? What do you guys I should let Grace me? know that I found her family astrolabe. I kind of don't want to. I'm not going to. Because I'm in the evil jerk. Which is difficult for me in these games. 
They also don't swim fast at all, which is annoying. Can I jump out of water? I hope I can climb the dock. I saw a thing the other day about like traversal in video games and like how you gotta make it difficult but not too difficult. Like, for instance, I can't jump up there, which is frustrating. And I know it's a small detour, but it's like, I don't know. How do you make traversal worthwhile and fun, but also make it easier? Hello, Grace. Because no one I likes tracking across I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible. Did you find the astrolabe? Okay, I'll extort her. I did, but it wasn't easy. I shall need to be compensated. I see. That's fair, I suppose. A reward, so to speak, for finding the buried treasure. Thank you for recovering it. Oh, she's You'd nice about well it. You do well to keep okay, an eye out for more spots to dive. It. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Okay, so anytime we see those bubbles, Thank you again. And I do hope you keep diving. You certainly have a knack for finding it's treasure. Like <laughs> Mermaid mask. I don't want to wear that. Okay, let's look at the gear we got. Da -da -ba 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 -ba. Neckwear. We got a new scarf that increases my offense. But it doesn't have cool dragons on it, which is too bad. But that's okay. Handwear. Checked gloves. Ooh, I like those better too. Good. And then uh, face wear. These were worse than my stupid glasses. When we that. And let's look at headwear. Verdant hat. Oh, I look like my favorite professor. Maybe. But I think is everyone's favorite professor. Because the internet is weird and scary place. All right, let's do this main mission. I must have come this way. Think. Dark wizard. Uh oh. I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi, speak of the devil. Oi, Mr. Rookwood <laughs> would like a word with you. A student, you can't be so. <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Oh, yeah. That was easy. What's easier than the goblins? Oh, I spoke too soon. What is this thing? Oh, watch the light go out of your eyes. Are you sure about that do list? Collection section of your field guys can update with new enemy types. May learn valuable insights on enemies such as their weakness to certain spells. Oh, I'm gonna eat. Okay, let's take a look. So collections. Enemies. Uh, spiders, only spiders. Okay, these guys, nothing. Uh Rookwood's agents, witches will surprise their opponents with back to back attacks and power will to reduct the first enough to block their shield charm. But interrupting with a cast with a severing charm will spin them to the point of losing control and hitting one of them. What's a severing charm? I don't think I have that yet. I'm not going anywhere with you. You take this! Pay for your Notice how the wizards just fly away, they don't actually, uh, like, burn what you stuff, just which happened. they should. I've never been accosted in such a manner, then so close to Hogwarts. You're welcome. Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent okay, defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood, thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Oops. My phone went off. I thought Merlin I was thought a myth. That Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were a myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. 
chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created mm. them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was Merlin terribly was fond of puzzles mm. and enigmas. I'm not sure old vine-covered pillars are worth studying. Well, I think anything concerning Merlin is worth pursuing, so and I shall have That's you funny. know. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. Hmm. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. Mallow This sweet. trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Sweet. There we go. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Sweet on the swell, and we'll see what happens. See that? The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these pyres. Incendio! Can I go to them and light them up, maybe? The flames make the pyre sink. Is that all we're supposed to do? So it's gotta be more complicated than that, right? What a day! I can hardly believe it! Rebellio! Hmm. So what I happened? take it we can call that a success. Why did I get that right? We can I thought indeed. it was supposed to be a puzzle. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. Hmm. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require Mallow Suite, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. Okay. I really I don't know if it's something I want to pursue, such but a pleasure we'll take a look. to meet you. Also, the and the, the, the views on the Hogwarts here. ones aren't now, great, got what so I, needed, I might not. I, shall return to the safety I might of just my play it myself. And books. Um, yeah, we can keep recording it. I don't know. We'll see. Um, okay, let's uh, oh, let's check out the map. And maybe do the next main quest? What are these? Merlin Trial. Okay, yeah, I don't really care about those. So where's the... Hogwarts? Is it Hogwarts? Is that Hogwarts? Okay. Library Annex. Yeah, nice. Go to Central Hall. Oh, okay. Oh, I should track it. I should have tracked it. I love this guy. So peaceful. Pa 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 pa. Um, then let's track you, and we'll go to potions class. 
Too bad it's not Herbology again. It gets dark out. Why is there potions flat? Maybe Auras or someone from the Ministry guarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade. Professor Black would never allow that. It would make him look completely incompetent. Okay, let's wait for class to start. Because it was nighttime and now it's daytime, so we just spent a whole day seeing the class. It was wonderful. Well, it sounds like there's a key around. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a wig and weld potion of your own. Nice. You never know when you might need it. Especially because we Please ran begin. out of those the other day. Love my new hat. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. Pork lump juice. Jeez. Start a cauldron. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need Did in my office. Do you think I'm going to have to do this every time? But in the future, Probably you'll not. be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see oh. me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. So he's essentially telling you to... Go off the beaten path and talk to us. My Ashman parents games, considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumor. I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office. Yes. He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary Weasley. opportunity. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. Wait. Are what percentage of the population is with her She's my aunt. Retired. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fupa feather. As you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. Hmm. Sure, I'll be I'll get dirt. you the Fwooper Feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fwooper Feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Remember, precision is key. Long refer. Ashman Rays with the Fooper Feather. Chest. Fooper Feather. Your potion should not be that color, Miss McDowell. Here's the Fooper Feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank this you! This guy seems like he's this not This is going to take a moment to brew. 
You should get back to brewing your Aduras potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Tell me how to live my life. Okay, um, let's see. You drop the ditch or crush it. What did you want me to brew? A Doris potion. Back. Loss of your eyebrows. Brewing time, 29 seconds. So it's already doing it. Okay. I don't know what I feel like. I, I, I and like now we have a mallow sweet. And that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Uh-oh. Uh Get it! <laughs> well done, Gareth. <laughs> Dummy. What now, Mr. Weasley? Ooh, I got my potion. Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. Mr. <laughs> Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. That's fine. I don't care about your stupid. Point. I brewed an Adorus potion. I'm a rebel. As you asked, I'm too cool for I'm your I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. <laughs> I'm not know sure what, you what you're talking about, Professor. You will not <laughs> earn favor with me by failing to take responsibility for your actions. I suggest you heed my warning. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Really now, I recommend that you find a safe location really? in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Okay. All right. Uh, we're only 20 minutes. I think each here, of us so has yeah, had enough so. excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. It just dismisses me. Like that. That's awesome. Oh, my roads are going to reap from Gareth's inspiration. Oh, stop complaining. Oh, I heard one of those things. Let's follow it. A portrait in our common room wants to talk to you. It's Eldritch Diggory. He used to be the Minister for Magic, I think. There we go. Oh, yeah, I forgot about it. I hate doing this. Damn it. Oh. Ah. Oh. This is so stupid. Like, why can't I just smack it and uh, pick it up? There we go. That was definitely mistimed, but they gave it to me anyway. Alright, let's go speak to the portrait of Eldritch Diggory. Eldritch. Eldritch, that's a cool name. That's very, um... What's it called? Um... Lovecraftian, almost? Let me... Let me go to Grand Staircase. I want to... Great Hall, Hufflepuff coming. Forgot I was Hufflepuff for a second there. Sorry, right? I'm a little tired, so. A little bit out of it. Let's talk to this guy. You wanted to see me, sir? Indeed. Allow me to introduce myself. So few students know who I am these days. Heldridge Diggory. Well, Former Minister for Magic Shedrick and Diggory? founder of the Aura Recruitment Program at your service. I believe you can help solve a decades-old murder, thanks to that book you found, and, in particular, its missing pages. How do you know about the book and the pages? We portraits hear more than you might suspect, and most of us can keep a secret. 
Yeah, so, except you're what say you? talking to Surely a Hufflepuff such as yourself anybody. would be inclined to help seek long overdue justice. Murder sentence. This could be right up my street. Even we Hufflepuffs enjoy a good mystery. Glad to hear you are up to the challenge. Plus, I believe you'll benefit from this undertaking. My great niece, Helen Thistlewood, can provide you with details. She's retired now, but was a skilled aura in her day. And the unsolved murder of which I speak was her case. I often visit my portrait in her home, in the nearby hamlet of Upper Hogsfield. Shall I tell her to expect you? Uh, I shall go and see her right time. away. Brilliant. With what I suspect is your knack for hard work and her keen mind, both mysteries may be solved sooner than you think. I shall see you there soon, I hope. Prisoner of love. Like it. Okay, let's open a map. A little fast travel. Whoops. Oh, cool. World map. Oh, it's pretty far north of Hogsmeade. Let's go to Hogsmeade. No, I don't want to. And we'll just travel to there. And then we'll run up there. And we'll see. And we'll probably fight spiders. And I'll get scared. And all those things. Let's do this. Ooh. There we go. There we go. There's a chest in here. It's probably locked though. Yeah. Always locked. Man, they did a good job at this game to like have the world and everything. I think. The sheep. Set on fire. Incendio. Oh, you little. Oh, you might have been at this for hours. I'm not gonna go down. I'm gonna go over here. I don't wanna fight those guys right now. I don't feel like it. Oh, now it's gonna go this way. Interesting. More balloons. What is that noise? I burned the pump. Oh, that's disappointing. A castle must have been quite stately in its time. Oh, Come out, you! Something? What was that? You may want to move. Slippery little thing. It isn't Laura Treadwell's guardian. No, no, no! Akio, incendio. You got nothing, boys. No. These dark it's wizards. It's shameful suck. what you've done to helpless beasts. Why would they do? It's shameful what they've done to helpless beasts. What they do? Like that, that farmer was just chilling there. Oh well. Let's keep moving. Huh. Speak to Helen Thistlewood. This must be the place Minister Diggory mentioned. Oh, lots Helen of lives around here somewhere. Ah, here you are. I'm pleased to see you took my advice. I'm not even going to read that. I don't care. All right. Madam let's see Thistlewood, what you have to say. I met your great uncle in his portrait in my common room. He sent me to speak to you. I'm pleased you came. Uncle Eldritch believes the book you found and its missing pages may be relevant to an unsolved case from my time as an aura. Very well. I'm listening. Decades ago, a student named Richard Jackdaw disappeared after going to meet a girl named Anne. Jackdaw. They That's never the name of the ship in, uh... When his headless ghost appeared briefly in Hogsmeade, Black flag, isn't unaware it? of how he died, Anne was convicted of his murder and sent to Azkaban. It was in large part due to the testimony of a girl called Apollonia Black. Jealous of Anne, I think. That sounds terrible, but I'm not sure how I can help. Anne's alibi was somewhat labyrinthine. She said Jackdaw promised her adventure following a map he found on some pages he'd stolen from Peeves. 
And you think Peeves ripped those pages from the book I found in the restricted section? If my great uncle is to be believed, yes. At least that's what the portraits at Hogwarts suspect. Anne insisted that Jack Daw had asked her to follow the map with him, but only after she solved a series of puzzles he'd prepared. What oh, oh, to rule a girl? Puzzles. She swears she never even solved the first puzzle, so they didn't meet. Jack Daw's ghost vanished almost as soon as he appeared. Without Jack Daw's puzzle, pages, or remains, Anne was sent to Azkaban based solely on Apollonia's spurious testimony. I don't understand. What can I do to help? Like the legal I believe Anne the may have, have solved terrible. the first puzzle by now, but after spending time in Azkaban, she's a shadow of her former self. She won't speak to anyone she doesn't trust, and she trusts no one. If you, a student with a connection to the pages like Jackdaw had, spoke to Anne, she might reveal new information. Well, I knew it. Anything to see I've always Azkaban, wanted to see course. Azkaban. Count me in. I suppose it has a peculiar appeal to some, but it can be terribly disconcerting. Fortunately, being a retired aura has its benefits. We can apparate right to her. I've escorted ministers, professors, and many others to that blasted place. Never a student, I'll admit, but I will keep you safe. Yeah, Very cool. well. Let's go. Steady yourself. We'll apparate together. Don't worry. I've never splinched anyone. Splinch. Do take care now. And tread lightly in that horrible place. Me. We'll be there in but a moment. Well, no, I'm worried about it. All right. Oh, sorry for the big yawn, everybody. I'm tired. I woke up early. I had a long day yesterday, too, so. Cool. That ought to keep them at bay for now. Important. Though, be aware, you may feel a wave of despair. It will pass. Thank you for the warning. This really is a dismal place, but we'll be out of here soon enough. Now follow me. The Dementals won't harm us now. Still, be careful. I never thought I'd see the inside of Azkaban for myself. Nasty Dementals. Not even I could convince the Ministry to send them off. There's no need for such monsters. Careful around, Anne. She's been here a lot longer than the rest of us. We're getting chirped by the prisoners. Love it. I'd cast Crucio on the lot of you! You don't scare me, young cur. They teach you so little of what you should know of. That witch you're with has a dark cloud over her. I can feel it. All of the darkness. My only friend. My only hope. The school's going to believe this. <laughs> no, now not. remember, Anne has been here a long time. The Dementors aren't kind. Have patience and speak to her quietly and respectfully. Are you Anne? Who's there? Who speaks to me? Is that death finally come for me? Oh I'm a student God. from Hogwarts. I found the book that you said would exonerate you. Ah, the book, the book. No one would look. None of the mages found the pages. Methinks the feckless knave meandered to his cave. My fate was surely sealed in Upper Hockey Field. Upper Hockey Field. Are you saying that the missing pages are in a cave? Near Upper Hogsfield? Hogs, hogs! Field, field, ruins house, a vault concealed. A vault in some ruins near Upper Hogsfield. I suppose it can't hurt to look. Can't hurt to look, can't hurt to look. Go find the pages from your book. 
Ellen. Ellen, now you're here. Come in closer, be a dear. How does she rhyme so effectively? Is that one of her magical what powers? What is it, <laughs> it's like a subdued version of Silence of the Lambs. What? Go. The cave. You're safe now. You have what you need. I'll be all right once I get. Interesting. All right, let's go check out that cave. But, Madam Thistlewood, I. How far away is it? All right. I'll find it. We won't I'll grab the cave. side missions yet. We'll do that when we come back. I cave. should investigate. We need giant spiders in it, isn't there? Stupid. I wonder if that's the only scene in Azkaban, because I did read that Hufflepuff's the only group that gets to go to Azkaban and they're not much of a mission, right? These rocks have seen better day. This must be the place Anne told me about. Lumos. No one's been here for ages. That door's gonna close for sure. Steal some money. Oh. Okay. There's some levers. Incendi. Yeah, it's there. Accio. Lumos. All right. Now. Accio. It's no wonder I never found that clue. <laughs> Maybe I just gotta keep trying. Nope. Are they staying out? They are. No, that's not it. Lumos. Okay, what am I missing here, people? Like there's no, I don't even see anything that I could look at. Maybe it's through here. Oh. Incendio. I really thought I could destroy these guys. Oh, I can. Okay. Accio. Just a chest. Okay. All right, let's take a look. Lumos. No. No. Hmm. How did you do this, Jackdaw? It's no wonder I never found that clue. No, yeah, that's not. Got it the Accio. Ah. ah, I see how this goes. I don't. But let's see the same thing on the other side. You can now whip me, Jackdaw. Now, where's the clue you left behind? Well done, you saw my puzzle, I knew you were a kindred spirit. <laughs> yeah, sure, my adventure will meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest. As soon as you can, I'll show you the map I mentioned. There's no telling where it will lead us. I found it on pages of the Earth in the Stupid Book, and no one else seems able to find. I haven't any idea what lies ahead, but I'm glad I should all share my future with you. Uh, P.S. I'm terribly glad you found it. I would have gone on alone if you not. What fun would that be? Well, I think you did go on alone. That's my impression. Oh, from Jackdaw. Huh? Anne never found it. So how did he die? Was she to blame at all? 
This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Yeah, everything's dangerous in this friggin' world, dude. Could it be? Has someone solved my puzzle after all these years? Well done indeed. Richard Jackdaw, at your service. The Richard Jackdaw? I heard you disappeared years ago. You have some explaining to do. I do? That was my puzzle you solved. <laughs> what are you doing here? A retired aura, Helen Thistlewood, told me about a map you stole from Peeves. And then Anne told me about a cave. You saw Anne? Broke my heart. I had to go on without her. Probably best for her in the end. Not Dare really. I ask? How is she? Oh, we're gonna be honest. You ruined her life. She was imprisoned in Azkaban for your murder. Why didn't you exonerate her? What? Azkaban? Oh, poor Anne. I had no idea. I thought she'd written me off. I've been traveling the world for years to mend my broken heart. I came back here only recently. On a whim. I must so speak to the aura you wherever? mentioned and see how I can help Anne. I'm glad to hear it. Are they like force ghosts? Before you go, would Are I still be able ghosts? to find the pages well, not, the Harry Potter's wasn't ghosts. I'm almost Harry's certain I dropped them in the cave the moment I was beheaded. They're bound to be mouldering away with the rest of me. Tell you what, meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you precisely where to find them. Thank you. I need to find those pages to help a friend. I shall see you there. All right, let's do it. Give me the ring. Who lived here, I wonder? Uh. 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 Pop-up quest. I'm not going to pop up. I'm going to go. I'm going to stop. There it is. How far is it? I need to learn to disarm each other. Okay, so that's probably a good place to end it. Uh, thanks for joining us, everybody. I hope the volume was good. Uh, we'll test it out. If it was too quiet, I'll see what it sounds like on YouTube. But uh, this has been Teacher Plays. Please give it a like, comment, subscribe. Class dismissed.